guys, my name is Kaichu and today we're gonna be doing a vlog video. It's been six years, maybe this is not something important, but trust me, this vlog is gonna be kinda making sense for me in future, because during the last, even before I started YouTube 2017, I had this chair. This is a Malcolm chair from Ikea, I bought it. Back in 2015, something like that. So this chair is around five to six years already in total, right? Now, look what happens when I just sit down on this chair, like typical sit down, right? Look. You can clearly hear how loud this thing is. It... It's breaking apart, it's creaky as hell, and this chair is going to the sideways a bit already. Even last, last video yesterday, it was very like loud as heck. So, anyways, this goes to trash. Or, I'm thinking, I might remove the bottom part and just keep the, the entire seat itself and maybe buy the same similar size and then change it to a new one. Well, this is a side. I got a new package. Luckily, this, my birthday was not long ago and a very good person close to my heart helped me to buy this chair. And it's called Hozara Gaming Chair Force 4.2 Grey. Let's check this out. Let's check this out. How is it gonna be? We need to be careful and well, I'm gonna unpack it because there might be leather at the start. As you can see, as you can see now, this is the first part of the chair, which is the arm for the arms. Let's put it here. Another one is similar. It smells new though. Smell of a new chair, honestly. Another arm for the another arm. Now there's this big box. I assume this is like a protection. Next thing we have is the regulator for the height. Up, down, up, down. The next thing we have here is... I think this is the top. Yeah, this is my... This is the back of the chair behind. Seems kind of huge. Not gonna lie, it's huge. The next thing we have here is a box. And I'm 99% sure this is the box with all the instruments, screws, instruments, metal, connection, instruction, everything. Next comes in, of course, the holder, made out of plastic. But I'm not gonna say it's just some kind of normal plastic. It's a very, 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 very big chunk of plastic. It's very thick. And the last part is, whoa, ah yeah, I forgot. This chair comes with two pillows, they for the head and for the back to rest. And the last part of the entire chair is the seat. So this is the seat. We're gonna be assembling this. And next time you'll see, the next picture you'll see is probably already legs assembled. So I'm not gonna to, to spend too much time putting it together because it's boring. So I'm just gonna be it in two parts, half and done. Okay, well, so so far we've made uh, we made wheels. So it's already holding the legs, the protection and the gas pump that holds the usually thing, the, the chair. And there is a top protection here. Next step is gonna be further, but so far I can tell that it's gonna be a huge one, I gotta say. It's gonna be a huge one and very high one. I hope that this chair will at least last for six years again, five years minimum, dude. Anyways, let's keep assembling. Anyways, lads, look, I'm just gonna do a little flip, look, gentle flip, and look, I'm not touching the ground. That's like a one circle already, dude. It's crazy, honestly. Oh yeah, I did it, it connected. You can now regulate the height of it. Well, uh, so far this has been a, night a nightmare to put. Hit my fingers, it's red as heck. My hands are shaking, dude. This is a nightmare to put. It, the screw had to force through the plastic. So it had to, it's almost correctly put every single time, but I would have to use the key, the wrench, this thing so tight that the screw had to pass through the piece of plastic a little bit to put inside and this was on everything it was a nightmare even my wife helped me to assemble it i just need to put the last thing is the two pillows but this is a kid's joke it's just like belts and that's it is done anyways let's test it out because as it is oh whoa shoot something cracked by the way you heard i don't know what it, i hope the plastic didn't break or some stuff Ah, oh, damn, this is comfortable though, I gotta say. I'm a bit too tall for this chair, but actually my head it does rest. It's comfortable, yeah? It has handles in there, so that's what matters. Anyways, let's keep assembling and then I'll put the last product. Anyway, lads, finally after 
God knows how many, maybe two hours already passed. They finished the chair. I put it correctly. This is supposed to go at least somewhere around here. Like at least how people hope, right? But in reality, it's all the way there. And I don't know if it's the correct way. Leave a comment if you know. This pillow is also kind of weird. Like it's supposed to, like this it does its job. But I don't know its purpose. It's supposed to help a back or some stuff like that. But I would maybe, maybe there's a chance. I will definitely remove this one if I don't find a use for it. And this one as well, but there's a high possibility. It depends. Maybe this one I'll consider because I don't always reach the very end. So. Anyways, lads, let's have an office probably wanting to sit down. So, well, I can tell that at the back, at the back, it's not that bad. Especially if you put it at the very bottom, right? At the very, very bottom. And you force it. Maybe you can have the usual of it. Fine. Maybe it's because it's new. But this one, I don't know, dude. This is the most weirdest stuff for me. Like, it feels so uncomfortable, the back, dude. So, what I'll probably do is... I'll probably just try to remove it. And I don't know. Maybe it needs to go like this. I don't know, man. Maybe I'm making a mistake. Maybe I'm doing it wrong. But I can only think of this, but it's gonna come off easy. I don't know. Like, it holds like this, but... Yeah, like, this is fine. I gotta say, this is fine. But do a little trip, like a little like this, and it's gonna come off. That's the thing. Maybe you need to be more comfortable. But I think, in general, like, maybe you can find a use for this one, for this pillow, like, normally. The company even did it wrong, I think. Let me check. I know, okay. Just this pillow and the problem, but everything else seems not bad, I gotta say. Maybe it's not that bad. Anyways, lads, I uh, hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, this is not gonna, probably gonna be the chair that you're gonna see in how many years. Yeah? Unless it breaks in two weeks, yeah. Huh. But anyways, have a good one, subscribe if you're new, and see y'all tomorrow with another video. Stay tuned for that. Peace out.